I'm ready to present the new model of economic development, shifting from an efficiency-driven model to an innovation-driven one, striking a balance between economic growth and social need, reduce Taiwan's dependence on a single market, build a strategic partnership with the U.S. on economic cooperation. For most Taiwanese, the state of our economy is a source of great distress, as it has stagnated for some time and has lost momentum for growth. Globalization and China's rise as the world's uh, factory have affected Taiwan's efficiency-driven model of economic growth. This has gradually resulted in a widening income gap outsourcing of job opportunities and stagnating salaries. The economic slowdown has hit the young generation in particular, who now face an economic environment much harsher than their parents' days. In addition, over various public pension, our various public pension funds have incurred huge implicit deficit that endangers their sustainability. Furthermore, the family-based traditional social safety network no longer suits the needs of the highly urbanized Taiwan. Under these circumstances, one can only imagine the tremendous burdens that are being placed on our younger generation. Therefore, providing a new economic way forward will be the foremost priority of the coming DPP administration. I'm ready to present the new model of economic development with core elements of innovation, employment, that is job creation, and equitable distribution. The primary objective of the new model is to reshape Taiwan's economic competitiveness by shifting from an efficiency-driven model to an innovation-driven one. It is also aimed at striking a balance between economic growth and social need. In addition, we hope that the new model can help reduce Taiwan's dependence on a single market and to ensure Taiwan's economic autonomy. We're kindly reminded by former Secretary Clinton in June last year that Taiwan will be vulnerable if it loses economic independence. I also fully intend to build a strategic partnership with the U.S. on economic cooperation. A DPB administration would like to mount intensive exchanges and cooperations on the next generation infrastructure for Internet of Things, cloud, big data, and ICT-based in industries, which features the fourth industrial revolution, or what many call Industry 4.0. I would like to have Taiwan work closely with American firms to renew Taiwan's ICT industries as well. On international trade, there is an urgent need for Taiwan to participate in the Trans-Pacific Partnership, that is TPP, at least to be included in the second round of the negotiations. For this purpose, I have set up a special task force to discuss the important aspects of the trade liberalization and the TPP. Our discussions include the need for structural adjustments and reform, the extent to which Taiwan should adhere to international standards, streamlining legal infrastructure and bureaucratic practices, and making the necessary investments in specific sectors. We want to ensure that Taiwan is ready to effectively deal with the challenges of globalization. I would like to thank the U.S. government for expressing welcome to Taiwan's interests. Here, I would also like to reiterate that we, I am determined for Taiwan to be ready for the D TPP.